When it comes to the world of Kidlet, there are very few authors who have withstood the test of time better than R.L. Stein and Judy Bloom. and after watching both of their masterclasses, I can also confirm that they are fantastic people with a lot of great things to teach all of us about the world of publishing. Happy Thursday and welcome back to the Circulation Desk where we dive into the world of publishing. Today, rather than sharing anything that I've learned myself with you, technically kind of sorta, I actually wanted to recommend a couple of awesome resources if you want to learn from the best of the best of the best. And by that I mean Judy Bloom and R.L. Stein. They both have courses up on masterclass.com. I've taken both of them, loved both of them, and absolutely think you should check it out. So masterclass.com is this website that does video courses with the best of the best in certain fields. There is everything from writing to chess to poker and more writing and TV writing. And I actually was lucky enough to get a year long subscription to masterclass.com. So all year I've been doing these courses, mostly focusing on the writing ones, but also kind of diving into some random stuff like cooking. But recently I've specifically been into the world of children's literature and writing for younger adults. And I am so in love with Judy Bloom and R.L. Stein, even though I haven't really read very many of their books. I know it's kind of blasphemy. I have read a couple of Judy Bloom books when I was a lot younger. I never really did the R.L. Stein thing, but you guys know me. I'm not a big horror fan, but watching him definitely made me want to watch the Goosebumps movie. And he just seems like such a nice guy. If possible, Judy Bloom seems like an even nicer person. She was just so incredibly sweet. Both of these people were really engaging and just dynamic to watch and so friendly and warm. I really, really recommend them as human beings. If nothing else, they seem like such fantastic people who have clearly been in the industry for so long and have so much valuable information to share. Since today is about the world of the publishing industry, I'll focus a little bit there, but they cover everything from their writing processes to how they come up with ideas. And then a little later in both of their courses, they go into things like getting an agent or working with an editor and learning what kind of recommendations from an editor you really want to listen to and how you should always be open-minded. R.L. Stein also goes into kind of how you want to craft a lifelong career in writing and some advice there. It is all so invaluable. I don't want to say too much because obviously the courses are there for you to check out. I do recommend getting the yearly pass rather than buying one particular course, no matter what it is you're interested in, because basically for the cost of two courses, you get all of them and they are fairly expensive. So that can add up pretty quickly. I think I've done like eight or something this year. So that has been entirely worth it for me. And I am going to miss it once my subscription goes away. There are so many other writing courses I have either done or want to jump into. I think my next one's going to be Margaret Atwood. So a very, very different vibe from Judy Bloom, but still all kinds of awesome. And yeah, masterclass.com is just a great way to get some advice from some of the best in the industry who would never get a chance to really sit down with and just pick their brain on the writing process, but this gives you that opportunity. There are other resources on the website, not just the video lectures, so you can do kind of workshops and ask questions to other people who are taking the class. There is some level of interactivity with the teachers. I mostly just watch the videos because I really enjoy that part of it, but there's a lot of different ways you can get this information and try to apply it to your own books and your own career. R.L. Stein and Judy Bloom are basically the top of their game when it comes to entertaining younger audiences. So if that's something you are interested in, I cannot recommend these enough. You should absolutely check it out either now or sometime in the future because I do think these courses will be here for some time to come. So it's not something you need to do right away, but absolutely something worth keeping in mind for the future. So that's it for me today. Don't forget to join us on Sunday for our next live chat. It will be at 7.30 Eastern time as always. In the meantime, happy reading, happy writing, and I'll see you next time.